All right, here we go. Here we go. That was Remember Me by Capcom. The new IP. It's nice to see uh, another female video game protagonist. Because uh, there's too many, too many male main protagonists in the uh, gaming industry nowadays. It's nice to see another new female addition. <sighs> Just can't wait till, till uh, Microsoft comes up with another perfect dark. Oh yeah! Joanna Dark. Females are just kicking ass this year. We had Tomb Raider, Laura Croft. Now we have uh, Nellan. Alright, so yeah. This game, is, this game is pretty good. I have mixed feelings about it. Some, some points in the game I didn't really like. Some of the platforming. Some of the platforming was pretty weak. Certain jump mechanics. Because <laughs> it seems like she wouldn't be able to like jump a certain distance. But then, surprisingly enough, she can. So I had a couple of points where I tried to jump and I ended up missing the ledge. Combat system was pretty weird too. You have to pause in between inputs to really change the combos. That slight hesitation. All the combos in like a fighting game, but yeah, I enjoyed it. It's all right. The story was pretty freaking twisted. I don't know what else to say about it. It's interesting. He's a uh, an heiress hacking minds and make you think that your best friend, you know, sleeping around with your uh, boyfriend or girlfriend. <laughs> That's pretty cool, man. Basically, you hack into that person's mind and tell them to give you all their damn money. Rich. Another game that uses an interesting concept like this, like hacking and stuff, is Watch Dogs. That's, that's one game I'm highly anticipating this year. Later on this year. That playthrough will come in due time. Surprise, Capcom. They actually pulled a rabbit out of their ass. This is a pretty good game. Good job. Capcom in. What else? What else worked on this? <clears throat> Pont. Pont. Don't nod. Oh, I thought it was a P. Don't nod. I'm looking at the back of the case. It says 30th anniversary Capcom. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. I wonder if they're going to come out with any extended. Uh, uh, character story mode. I'm, I'm interested in playing as some of the other characters. I wonder if they'll do that, come out with some DLC we could play as maybe Bad, find out how he got captured, play as Olga a little bit. And, uh, who's that one guy? Tommy? What's his name? Yeah. Uh, yeah, nice. Solid game. How long did it take me to beat this game? Back over here. Let's see if it's worth the money. Hours. Are you getting enough hours for your uh, content here? Let me see. It took me, let's see. About 10 hours. 10 hours to beat the game. Bad. That's so that's a right, but I don't know. People expect more. At least a good 15 hours of gameplay. 14, 15 hours of gameplay. Solid. They did what they did. They 
extent of the story. It was like 10 chapters, 9 or 10 chapters. If you count the prologue, this is chapter 8, so it's about 9 chapters total. Fairly short. But, uh, I just kind of wish it was more like uh, Devil May Cry. Just a little bit. A little bit more fast paced. Probably would have enjoyed it more. It had a nice little pacing. Some hand to hand combat. Some platforming. Here and there. Environments were, were nice. You did a lot of backtracking to the same environments and see how, how you changed the world a little bit. I went from being a nice, peaceful, civil, you know, environment to just destruction and chaos. That was interesting. And I wonder if she has any more combos because she only had like four or five different combos that I unlocked. Well, like you can unlock some more inputs too by finding all the the uh, SAT no no the SAT stuff um, builds up your your health and your um, your power your uh, your juice I guess I'll call it the blue bar the blue bar stuff. Where's my controller? Oh, ready. Alright, but we'll definitely take a look and see what's what. See how many stuff I missed. Here we go, man. Oh, wait, hold on. There we go. Business operations! Why are the credits moving so damn slow? What's happening here? <clears throat> Associate Manager, QA Bug Check, Sean Hulahan. Associate Manager, QA Content Analyst, Mark Rodriguez. Associate Manager, QA Progress Management. Rio Rigiro Sato. Uh, <coughs> Man, these are some slow moving credits. <laughs> oh man, another thing that pissed me off about this game is the load times. Dear lord, what is wrong with the load times? When you die, it takes like a full 60 seconds for the game to boot back up. Like, what is happening? I installed it to my hard drive and everything. Can you imagine if I didn't do that? Actually, you can see because I think the first episode I uh, I was playing through it without the game installed on my hard drive. The load times were just ridiculous. Why? Why? Why are we on that? a next-gen console, Xbox 360, and the load times are taking 60 seconds? I can't wait for the new console. PS4 and Xbox One. Localization by Q Lock SI. Oh man. I go drive to the gas station for some gas in my car. Come back, credits will still be on. No, screw that. Go to the gas station, fill up, fill up on gas, go to Subway, think about how I want my sandwich made, tell the associate what to put on the sandwich, have them toast it, pay for it, drive home, and the credits will still be rolling.